Migrants here in our state are now heading to federal court suing to get the right to have a driver's license. A new state law already let immigrants from Ukraine get licenses and IDs, but the ACLU says that is discrimination. Angelica Robinson talked with one of those immigrants on the lawsuit about the challenges that he faces every day. I spoke with one man from Haiti who's listed as a plaintiff on this lawsuit. He says the ability to drive shouldn't be based on the country that you came from. Instead, it should be based on your ability to follow the rules of the road. Going to work, taking a trip to the grocery store, or getting to an appointment proves to be challenging for some. I was trying to get my driver's license in order to be able to go to work, and then I discovered that I was not eligible. Jefferson St. Hilaire came to Indianapolis from Haiti under humanitarian protections, but he's not legally able to get a driver's license or state ID. Having a driver's license is not just about convenience, but it's a basic necessity. He faces challenges getting to work and using rideshare services cuts into money that he may otherwise use to help take care of his family in Haiti. He says he's not alone. They want to help and how can they do that if they're not able to go to work, if they're not able to drive? A new law makes exceptions only for immigrants from the Ukraine. The ACLU says that law is unjust. They are not allowed to do so, even though the exact same person would be allowed to do so if they happen to come here from Ukraine. That, that is discrimination. The ACLU filed a lawsuit challenging it. Lawyers with the ACLU and the National Immigration Law Center went before a judge asking for a preliminary injunction. That injunction would require people from other countries here under the same status to get a license. It's unclear when a decision will be made by the judge, but she says that she will make one very soon. Reporting in Indianapolis, Angelica Robinson, 13 News.